Hey, what's going on, y'all? It's your boy, Laron. We back with another video. You see the thumbnail, you see this video's about, but before we get into this video, I wanna say what's up to my subscribers. Also, if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you are new, please consider hitting subscribe and turn on notifications, because on this channel, we do thought-provoking videos, reaction videos, such as this one right here, and once a month, I do a review on the black-owned products. So if you're into that kind of content, hit subscribe and turn on notifications. All right, let's get into it. So we have this um, demonstration that's going on in New York City. So New York City protesters shut down a Panera Bread or Panera. I think they took the bread out. I don't know. That's not the, the story. The story is they shut down a restaurant because they're protesting the mandates. They still protest, protest the mandates in New York City. So I'm going to show you guys a news clip of what I came from. It came across um, freedomnews.tv. I'll put it, um, the link in the description box so you guys can check out the video in its entirety. This is, this is what's going on in New York, man. This is what's going on in New York. People who work at these places such as like Panera Bread, uh, security guards against these um, protesters. So let's get straight into it, man. Let me pull this clip up. They have bosses on top of bosses that have See, so now, you know, the people came into the restaurant. Uh, they sat themselves down because I, I didn't show the earlier the clip. But they sat themselves down because they says a fire hazard. So now you have a fire hazard. You have all these people crowding up in the in the middle of the restaurant. And what the restaurant do, they call the police. And now the police is saying, like, you know, you guys just got to leave. You know, they got their bosses. They got to work here. And it's messed up for the people who got to work here. And also messed up to the police that, you know, this is what you got to use your resources for. You got all these police officers came down to Panera Bread because people are protesting uh, the shot mandates. It's crazy. <laughs> You should know that. You don't even know where you're saying. You wouldn't know. You wouldn't know. It's not funny. You're not supposed to know. I have a for business. So I need everyone to leave. We can leave. You can leave out this door or the front door. Okay. Sure. Either way. No problem. Look at this. Look at all the police officers that came to this call. That the people that is not taking a shot can't get served. This is such a waste of resources, man. All that crime going on in New York City, you got police officers out here fighting this. Okay. Doing this to you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. you can leave out this door or the front door. How much do you think this lady get paid to have to put up with this? I don't care if it's twenty five dollars an hour. It's not worth putting up with people coming into your establishment and saying that you have to serve me, even though the law or the mandate say you can't. But I'm a protest saying that you should. You have to be in the middle. You have to be the mediator between the protests. It's messed up. Everybody to leave the restaurant. Can I ask you guys a question? We closed the business because of this. So now they closed down the whole Panera Bread at this location because of this protest. So the employees are going to lose out of money because they're not working their full shift. The store is gonna lose out of money because they had to close down. The police officers gotta come out there using their resources to fight against this. And these people just wanna get served and have equality because they don't got the shot. At the end of the day, nobody's really in the wrong except for the people who's putting these things in play. Okay. We just wanted to eat. You guys could have served. We're them. closed for business. Really? Yep, we're closed for business. You guys closed so early today. Well, we closed because. Hang on outside. I guess we'll go eat somewhere else. Okay. Who's business? Come on. Right. We'll go. They closed for business. Yeah, we're gonna have to leave. They closed. Need help getting out? No. Got it. Okay. That's 
fun. We went today to uh, Panera Bread and uh, we did, we demanded to be served and they did not let us eat inside without our vaccine cards. So we decided to sit down in the seating area and what happened was the, uh, the employees ended up calling the cops and they brought out like 30 cops and they shut down the entire store and they closed out the store and they kicked us out. I mean, you guys get the gist of it. Like I said, in the description box, I keep, I put a link to the full video. But yeah, man, what's your thoughts on this, man? He's, now you got the people, you know, run up in these stores. You know, it's been going on for like, since um, de Blasio put out the keys to the city. What's your thoughts on this, man? You're, thought, you're thinking that um, this is a good way of going about it? I think if you got an issue with it, man, take it up with the people who made the decision. Don't take it up with the people who have to enforce it. Because clearly, they look uncomfortable. They know it's stupid. They f they look like, I don't want to be part of this. They look like, I don't want to be a part of this. Like, what am I doing here? That's what it looked like. That's what it looked like to me. What am I doing here? But, you know, I just think that it's really messed up that this is where the resources are going to. It's going to people saying that they want to get food at Panera Bread. And we got all these cops coming down here because people want to get food at Panera Bread. But let me know what your thoughts on this, man. And let me know what your thoughts about what's going on in New York City as well. As far as all these... um mandates and protests and everything that's going on because clearly clearly this ain't it this ain't it but um that's my thoughts on it man i appreciate your time leave something in the comments all right man till next time peace